staff. Well, today students competed in the fourth annual Alamo City Electrothon, one of just 12 sanctioned electric car racing events in North America. Students from area high schools, even Louisiana, competing to raise awareness for STEM education and programs. Photojournalist Robert Samaron captured the sights and sounds of today's race. The fourth annual Alamo City Electrothon to uh, show the importance of STEM education. It's the coolest thing I've ever seen inside of a public school setting. Where we're excited about offering the Alamo City Electrothon, a lot of these school districts didn't have some of these programs like CT or STEM. And so this planted some seeds and now what some of these teams started as vocational clubs are now all out programs in these school districts. This is really where the rubber meets the road as far as taking that knowledge that they have in class and giving it a real application that they, that they can see, that they can feel, that they can touch. With just the hands-on component of it, we've, I've had to put so much work into it. And so it's so much effort. Us as a team, we've all had to put so much work and effort into this. A lot of kids from different backgrounds and different strengths. You've got kids that are just, you know, real kind of, you know, nut and bolt type kids, uh, gear wrenches, and uh, you've got kids that are more into fabrication. You have kids that are more into just the science part of it. You've got some kids that are more into the design aspect of, of trying to figure out how these parts are going to go together and planning the overall look of the vehicle. And they, they really have to work all together to make that final product actually happen. We've been working on this project ever since school started, so months, it's been months now. Tomorrow is when they're going to hit the track and put some laps in. And I mean, it feels pretty cool, a little bit uncomfortable, but it is what it is. It feels very good to get this far. Just getting it to run and drive smoothly has been a struggle, but we've been able to do that and so surpass that, so we're excited to, excited for the race.